Hello YouTube and right now I'm going to show you how to make your server 1.9 pre-release. So download that thing. Update their services here. That's where it says it. You click on that. Go to download. You go to your downloads. Uh, I already have it on my desktop I think. Well I put it right there anyways. Move and replace for me. I'm just going to rename it so there's no underscore. Um, let's see. And you can just start it off from right there. Just double click on the jar file and your server should start up. And if you don't want a GUI on it, which is this ugly, ugly fucking, I don't know what the hell this is, but I don't like it. Makes me lag and stuff, so. One way you can fix that is if you have Windows 7, you can use this thing. It all depends where you install your Java, so in parentheses have your Java. Not parentheses, but those quotation mark things. Put where your Java is, dash, xmx, whatever your, your stuff or how much RAM you want to put into that server. And the jar name, which is Minecraft server.jar and to make it no GUI you just press space and type in no GUI and I have that echo off on top and pause at the top so save shit oh, let me find the main file to this so right there copy paste and to make this you're going to need to go to notepad and I guess I'll just put this entire thing in the description, but I have Java JRE 7, whatever you want to call it. Just a more earlier version, so if you're going to do that, just make sure you have the right Java EXE and folder and stuff on it. And so once you get here, oh, oh damn it. Yeah, shit, wait, let me turn on my Skype. Uh, and you won't be able to hear me again, people in the call. Okay, so I guess, yeah, I want to go grab pizza, so pick you have all this whatever yeah that's where I stopped what you want to do is save as save as go to all files and type in whatever start dot bat make sure it says dot bat if not it's not gonna work and when you got that down it will look just like that though just do this way As you can see, the same thing. When I start it up, it should have no GUI, just like that. And there's your server. And to make that server work, you either port forward or you smotchy or something else. I can hear myself echoing for something. Hold on. And if you hear any background noises, it's because my sister has friends over and they're playing music because it's her birthday, so. What was I doing? Okay. Go to CMD or your control command thingy. Should be something like this. And I am going to type in IP config. Enter my IP's point that point three. So you wanna go to IP chicken and just leave that up. And that's my IP, so you need to know that. I don't know why, I forget. Alright, this is so you can have people join your server. Second of all, if you're using Machi, I might just add that in later. Probably not, because I am a bit busy, and 1.9 came out today, so I thought, yay, more views I can get, so. I don't know what router you guys have, but I have a Netgear. And so, what you want to do to get to your Netgear setting router thingy, is you want to go to your router box thing, look around, look for a website, look for admin, password, something like that. And so, mine is routerlogin.net and admins admin passwords password so that's simple and you want to go all the way down to this area or somewhere I don't know but I have net gear so mine's already set up so I'm gonna just show you how to do that uh, delete custom okay so well service name I don't know custom service can 
Okay, well, my sister just walked in like a special person, and so back to this. Server IP 1.9, blah 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 blah, point three. That's that's where you get yours from. So if you forgot IP config and your IP before address or whatever, it just looks right. But mine is that I don't know what yours is gonna be. And so your name, I don't care what the hell you name it, but I'm gonna just name Minecraft because I'm gonna need this eventually to host small servers. And your starting port will be two five five six five, and your end port should be the same. And you press e uh, apply, and it'll make it for you. Okay, so I don't have one point nine per release yet, but I'll just include it in the installation of it later. So yeah, it should work just fine. If you have problems, give me a comment, like the video, subscribe. Um, by the way, the, this is setting stuff, so, um, yeah, and I don't know, sometimes it doesn't work, so just make sure you put in your IP that you port forwarded in there, just make sure, and um, yeah, that's about it to make a server, so yeah, goodbye.